Hello everybody, Izumi here, and today let's do Chromatic Crystal Conflict. Try saying that uh, five times really fast. So, first in my party is going to be the Bird God. Alright, next is going to be a Sand Grid, of course. And third is going to be Infected Sith. A good, this is a good fight to use your um, non-elemental weapons on. And Nyatasha, who should be getting woke pretty soon, hopefully. And last but not least, Eve Horn Raspy. You gotta love that uh, Raven Blood bow. All right, so let's get on with the fight. All right, so first we got Forsetti, who is already a pain to deal with. She does her regular skill when she does that. So, yeah, keep that in mind because um, it does the exact thing that a regular skill does, quick and all. Um, but her auto skill is a light attack damage five times to all player parties, as well as light wound for three turns. And Holy Chain. The Holy Chain and Light Wound only affect humans, elves, and Yotan. And she also has High Holy Field as well as Gravity Field. So, yay. Alright, now let's talk about the fun part. The stupid crystals. The crystals of many colors. Alright, first one's going to be the Light Crystal, which does Front Ally. Which, Front Ally in this case is always going to be Forsetti. So, Forsetti gets skill gauge 10% up two times. And the crystal also does two enemies with the lowest defense and three enemies with the lowest light resistance. It hits them with light attack three times. So, yeah, you're going to want to get rid of that crystal quick, the light crystal. And also the Dark Crystal is pretty much the same thing. Um, skill Gauge 10% up the, for, to Forsetti two times and two enemies with the lowest defense and three enemies with the lowest Dark Resistance get hit by Dark Attack damage. So, let's get rid of that Crystal. Let's get on to the fun ones. The Earth, the Earth Crystal does Front Ally Row quick. And defense up 30% for one turn, and all of its allies get stone skin, as well as enemies with the lowest earth resistance get hit with earth magic attack damage. And it's the exact same thing for the fire crystal. Front ally row, quick one turn, um, defense 30% up for one turn, all allies stone skin, as well as hitting three with the lowest fire resistance with fire uh, damage. So get rid of the crystals. It'll make the fight a whole lot easier. Um, in my I chose to mainly go with um, dark damage and non-elemental and then let my character skills kind of do their work like you know sand grid infected Sif and Nyatasha should have no problem with that dark with that light crystal and you know change your heroes out to, to fight your crystals is what I usually do Alright, let's see who did the most damage here. Of course, and thank you for watching. 